Well, everybody, thanks for tuning in. It's been a while since I've been doing any fishing or at least any catching, so I'm going to do something a little different. This is going to be a complete review of the Ozark Trail collapsible wagon. And I'm reviewing this because this is what I use to haul all my fishing equipment to where I'm going to fish. I, I do a lot of fishing from the bank and uh, I needed a way to carry all my stuff, my bait, my rods, my, my lunch, my tackle boxes, my batteries, my GoPro cameras, all that stuff. I think I found a good product. I'm going to review it here in detail and there is one flaw to it and uh, I'll eventually get to that. Other than that, I'm going to point out everything about it. I've been using it for probably four or five months. So I think I'm qualified to tell you how it is. So here we go. And I think the first thing we'll do, put it down. And this is how it looked when it came down in the box. It's totally collapsed and folded up nice and neat. It's not that heavy. Fits in the trunk of your car, fits in the back seat, fits, you know, anywhere you want to fit it. Okay, so when you get it out of the box, it comes just like this. We're going to open it up, show you the features of it, and uh, show you how to get it back together real nice and easy. So here we go. What we're going to do, first of all, there's a zipper here. We're going to unzip this. Pretty simple. These, are, these will become the sides, as you'll see. Now there's a strap that goes around and holds all this in together tight. And that's held with Vel Velcro right here. I'm going to undo that. And then you just kind of pull the thing up. You pull it apart. Push down the bottom. And you got your cart. Now you take this part out. This is the actually floor. This is the floor. It's a folding hard floor that fits right down in there. Makes a nice neat area to put all your stuff. The cargo bag is zipped permanently on the side here and you just zip it up. Now this is the one flaw that I have found in this whole thing. These zippers, when you zip them up, there's no way to really secure them. So as you put stuff in here and start moving along, the zippers have a tendency to start opening up like that. Other than that, it's the only thing. The zippers are of good quality. They should last a long time with uh, little care. So you got a bag here for odds and ends. You got two bags here that are fit water bottles real easy. And then you got a bigger compartment here for any other stuff. Now there's another feature here that I like. I'm going to turn it around a little bit. This has, I think it, I think it's a 225 weight capacity. This has a tailgate that's easily opened up. If you have something long or longer than this, and you want to go and you want to lay it flat, drop the tailgate down with a couple of simple latches that unlatch. Lay it right down in there, and you're good to go. The frame, the folding frame is of really good quality. It's going to hold up for you. And I'm going to talk about that weight capacity a little bit. I weigh 168. <laughs> you can, I can get right in here. Take a break if I had a pillow. I could use this for a little nap time while the fish are biting. But uh, there it is, it's not being strained at all. We're going to move to that. <laughs> Close up the tailgate, secure the, the little clips. Now I'm going to turn around again because 
talk about the handle right here. When you're pulling this thing, this is just the way it is when it's stored. So when you're going to pull this, you're going to pull it straight up. It'll latch in. If you need it to be a little longer, pull this lever up here. Comes out another six or eight inches. Lock the lever in place. Put that down. As you can see, pretty good deal. Now, let's talk about the wheels. The wheels themselves, again, good quality wheel. However, they're not real thick. They're just, it's a hard rubber. So this is, this thing is good for curse one concrete or macadam. It's good for a uh, grassy surface that isn't too mushy. I don't think it would be any good in the sand because the wheels would sink in. They do make a different wagon. I think it's called like an all-terrain or something and the wheels are I think three inches wide or so. So that's going to be a little better in the sand. So I wouldn't drag this out onto the beach unless I had those bigger wheels on. Anyway, fairly simple. Everything fits in here pretty good. I usually carry a, a five gallon bucket with bait in it, my tackle box, my lunch pail, three or four rods and reels that I have sticking out the back. As you'll see here when I demonstrating the, the, uh, the whole thing being pulled. Alright, let's close it up and show you how that should work. I want you to get used to closing it up. It's pretty easy to do. First thing you want to do is let this handle back down. So close the handle. And there's two, two little push buttons here on the side. And you got that handle right back down where it should be. Next thing you're going to do is take the floor out, fold it up, put it in its designated pouch. And take your stuff out of here, whatever the case may be. Now you're going to undo these zippers. If they haven't already undo, undone themselves. <laughs> and there's a, there's a black uh, pull strap in here. Right there. Just pull this up. Wax is up pretty easy. Now remember that black strap I told you about? That's here. And you're going to want to get this prepared before you go any farther. So bring it around and lay it down. Just like that. Now here's the important part. These wheels here, turn them so the larger part of the wheel is pointing down. You don't want them like you don't want them like that. You want them like this, and they make sure they go in between the other wheels and push push down, and that collapses pretty easy. The black strap now comes up. Just push. You do a little bit of push down if you want. Secure that strap with the Velcro. Stand her back up. You're gonna bring the flat back around, put, put the zipper together, zip it up, and you're ready to put it right back in your trunk, or your back of your SUV, or whatever you're putting it in. But uh, there you go. It's a good product. It works great for what I've used it for. I found it to be to save a lot of back and forth from the car to the river or to the lake or whatever you're fishing. So if you're looking for a good easy way to carry all your stuff around, get one of these. Uh, I think Walmart has them. I don't know how much they are right now. I think I paid like 50 or 60 bucks for it. Uh, they're probably ten dollars now, but <laughs> whatever the case may be, worth every penny. That's the Ozark Trail foldable, collapsible, carry-all wagon. Hope you like it. Mm -hmm.
those of you that have seen some of my other videos, you might notice a little bit of change here in my area that I do most of my videos. Put some paint on the walls, changed a few things around, gave it a better, cleaner look, and uh, it's kind of like it.